What is up my kings and queens? Shaman Cash is king. Today I'm going to be showing you how to correctly receive and store a whole plethora of vehicles. Alright, so as you can see I've just got done with the DMO drop and I've got a lot of vehicles to put away on my second character. Now some of them are special vehicles, some of them are personal vehicles. We need to go through the process of receiving these all correctly and storing them on this account so that we don't give ourselves any dead slots. And I want to make sure that I can do this in the same session without ever getting unglitched. Alright, so we're going to go through a couple of different processes here so that we can obtain all of these newly dropped vehicles to ourselves and get them stored where they belong. Alright, and so I've got my first console here with me. You see your man Cash is king. Now you may have a friend helping whoever was the one responsible for dropping the vehicles. Alright, now it's very important that this person does own an apartment here at Give Cars to Friends Boulevard at 0605. Alright, and this is going to help make this process a lot easier. We don't want to have to go through motorcycle club invites or CEO invites. We want apartment invites from our friend. Alright, now I've got the Carbon RS here. A unique motorcycle that I like to keep stored in the back of my MOC. This is the vehicle that we refer to as our push vehicle. So I'm already glitched out. And I use the dead spot method to get glitched out on my character. So I'm just going to go ahead and do the beginning of the Give Cars to Friends glitch. And I'm also going to be attempting to do special vehicles to begin with. I always like to try, start, try to start my days with special vehicle trades if that's what's in the mix. And so, first thing I'm going to be doing is breaking right into the facility. Alright, and so as you can see I've gotten glitched out and I've already returned my motorcycle to storage because that motorcycle was stored in the back of my MOC I did not get the full alert you calling so for some wheels? I've been I'm Johnny from on the spot I'll hook you the back up back of my MOC because of my friend I will be in the state of on the way so I can just go ahead and choose to get a vehicle to tie to my personal vehicle slot and this is going to be the type of vehicle we're going to receive so I called the thruster and you can see I have it on my mini map and this is going to be the new thruster that I received from DMO. Now I just want to make sure that I have a correct corresponding slot for each special vehicle that I receive. So if I have a thruster that I'm going to receive, I need to have a thruster on the map. Alright. Once you come out you can go ahead and get inside of the thruster that you're about to receive from DMO and you'll notice that I'm going to be in a black MOC now if you're just trading with your friend you're just going to be inside of your MOC and you should be able to walk out but me because I'm pulling story mode vehicles I'm going to need that apartment invite from my friend. And this is why it's so very important to have your friend who's helping or your console one to have this apartment at Give Cars to Friends so that they can just quickly run inside after standing at the back of your MOC and send you an apartment invite. Now as you can see, I entered but I fell straight through the map. And sometimes this does happen, but you don't have anything to worry about. We're still ready to go. Alright, and so at this point, we just received a new thruster on the thruster slot in the back of our MOC. And we also pushed our push vehicle into the thruster spot at the facility. You need now, something, huh? When you ride, let me know. And we look we can see at the facility that at the bottom of our list where our thruster once belonged our carbon RS from the back of our MOC on a personal vehicle slot is now stored in its location because we have to remove the thruster and the thruster slot from its location and stored it back in the MOC we need to quickly swap these things back Aye, I'll All get right. back to work now the facility does have quite a strange dynamic 
and that dynamic is where even though this carbon RS is stored in its location as if we were trading helicopters or perhaps your regular special vehicle set if we have our friend to get on the back of this motorcycle in the attempt to help us get frozen at the back of the MOC even though we know it comes from the thrusters location we will still get the clubhouse alert and we will not be able to get glitched out all right and so there is a workaround to this and it's very very simple and all you're going to want to do is return that unique motorcycle to storage and leave it there it's holding the thruster spot no problem all right so i'm just going to go ahead and use my mechanic and i'm going to request out one of any of the first seven personal vehicles that are need, on boss? my list Some from the facility. I can bring them around. Now the facility obviously has a strange dynamic where it does have your four personal vehicle, your four special vehicle slots and seven personal vehicle slots, as well as the Avenger, which is a service vehicle slot. But we just need to be able to call one of these vehicles out and one of these personal vehicles even though they're not in the location that the thruster belongs these will allow us to get the full alert when we pull to the back of the MOC alright and as you can see I've already pulled my donor car from the strip club with the interior and my liveries so that I'm ready to flip a couple of these pieces that need flipped so I can have a fully clean set but this vehicle you don't have to worry about losing we're just going to be using it to bypass that full alert. And this vehicle is known as the bypass vehicle. And as you can see, I've now got the full alert. My friend will be kicked out of the car and I'll be unfrozen. And we can go ahead and return this vehicle to storage. All right. And because we're in a state of limbo, we can now choose a slot that we would like to use to push. And so we can call our push vehicle back out that carbon RS and once that carbon RS shows up on the map we just need to give it to ourselves, and we can complete the circle and we'll get our thruster right back where it belongs alright perfect now as you can see I still have the original copy of this vehicle that came from DMO stored in my MOC but because I'm using my motorcycle, I didn't have to worry too much about getting banged around. Now, even though I see this copy here, I know that I've successfully pushed the thruster and the thruster slot to its location. But I'm going to go ahead and get in this dead copy and try to drive it out. And you'll see because it's moved, it will take you a second to get in and get out. But once you drive it out, you should see your motorcycle follows along on the mini map as it's ahead of me here in the MOC and this thruster is simply a street vehicle at this point okay and it is not mine it's not the version that I own if I call my mechanic I can see that the version that I own I have successfully pushed from my MOC to the facility the what back you want? in the Some thruster wheels? location with the thruster slot where it belongs all right all good okay so i got stuff to do we're already set up to receive the next car we have our unique motorcycle from the back of our moc i'm just going to have my friend to get back on this motorcycle with me so that he can prevent me and we're going to go ahead and burn through the same process one more time Now as you can see, the same thing is going to happen every time I receive these vehicles because they're from DMO. But if you're doing these as just a regular trade, I suggest you kind of run the same process if you happen to get trapped in your MOC. Normally with the Kanjali, you should be able to get out, but you might get knocked into the black screen with the RCV or the Chernabog. And so it's just best to prepare and have your friend with this apartment next to you so that if that does happen you can get your apartment invite and get right out now I'm just gonna go ahead and burn through the rest of these facility vehicles and we'll get back with you here once I get caught up 
and decide to finish this circle. It's coming at you. Since the next on the list is the RCV, make sure that I request my RCV out. I've returned my purse vehicle to storage and it's in the back of my MOC. After I get my Franklin alert, I'm ready to receive the next facility vehicle. Now, as you can see, that apartment invite sometimes is the most important key to getting through this quickly. So I highly suggest that you or your friend have it stored. All right, so now that we have our unique motorcycle, our push vehicle back in the MOC, we've successfully received the four facility vehicles. We can go ahead and call our mechanic and see on our list that they are correctly stored in their locations. You calling for some wheels? I'm Johnny on the spot. I'll hook you up. I'll get back to it then. Alright, so now you just want to go ahead and have your friend get on and pause. And we're going to move right into the next special vehicle. Alright, and now the next special vehicle is a vehicle not a lot of people believe is a special vehicle. But if you do receive one of these before you own them, you will find yourself a dead slot when it comes time to fill your account. And that is the Cerberus from the arena. All right, you must own one before you receive one. They are a special vehicle slot. It is targeted to that type of vehicle and that type of vehicle only. You will be able to put a personal vehicle on top of that slot, but you can also receive one before you own it and push out a locked slot and give yourself a dead slot. So, because you must own one, we're going to go ahead and follow through the same process as a regular special vehicle. I'm going to be following the same process some, huh? as the facility vehicles. Let me know. And that's why I've decided to stack these two together today. And so, after my friend gets on the motorcycle I'm and I'm frozen, my slot is in a state of limbo. I've returned my unique motorcycle to storage. And I am going to call out one of my Cerberuses with the Cerberus slot from the arena. And you can see mine is just stock. But now that it's on the map, I'm ready to get the Franklin alert. And I can go ahead, enter a loan, and take the new Cerberus from DMO. And the same thing's going to happen with this one. I will push the unique motorcycle from the back of my MOC into the Cerberus location in my arena. Alright, now perfect. 
after you've completely re received the Cerberus and you've pushed your unique motorcycle from the back of your MOC into the Cerberus's location in the arena, you can go ahead and call just to verify what you need, boss? Some wheels? mechanic I can bring that around. in your arena, in that slot, you should have your unique motorcycle. Aye, I'll get back now, to work. This is exactly the same as the facility. Even though I know that my unique push vehicle is in the Cerberus's location, and I know that I'm able to get the full alert when I do typical special vehicles, but the Cerberus, just like the facility, if I attempt to use this unique motorcycle at the back of the MOC, I will not get the full alert. I will get the clubhouse alert. And so, once again, we're going to have to call a bypass vehicle and this vehicle can just simply be any personal vehicle from the arena workshop and it can be in the arena floor B1 or the arena I'm floor on the B2 clock. What you want? Some it doesn't wheels? really matter it just has to be a personal vehicle so I have a fag that I'll you. call out and again this is just our bypass vehicle and it's going to allow us to get the full alert Now that I've got the full alert and my friend's been kicked off, I've successful in putting my character slot in a state of limbo, I can feel free to use my motorcycle club and request my unique motorcycle. Since we have bypassed the full alert, I'm now ready to force push and give myself my own unique motorcycle. And once again, this will effectively allow these vehicles to swap locations and the Carbon RS will be in the back of my MOC and the Cerberus from BMO will be stored inside of my arena. And as you can see, there's a lot going on inside of my MOC at this point because of all of the vehicles that we've got received. I'm going to go ahead and need my friend to just send me out another apartment in back. All right, perfect. We've completed the circle. Again, if you'd like to verify, you can go ahead and use your mechanic and check inside of your arena at the floor that your push you vehicle through to your garage. has came you, uh, from need and me to see bring you a ride? that the Cerberus is now stored in your arena in its tent slot in the correct location that it belongs. Okay, I got stuff also, to do. Also, we completed the circle, so if I request a personal vehicle from the back of my MOC, I will once again get my unique motorcycle that we know as our push vehicle. I'm just going to go straight on in to receiving this last special vehicle which is going to be the AA trailer. As you can see I did not get the full alert because this vehicle was stored there. I'm going to go ahead and go through with the AA trailer methods. And I first need to clear the map. Alright, so I've returned my unique motorcycle to storage. I've also returned my AA trailer to, or my MOC to storage. I'm just going to have my friend to run across the street so that he's not viewing Give Cars to Friends Boulevard when I'd like to request out my MOC. Alright, so now that I have no vehicle showing on the map, I can go ahead and tie a brand new vehicle to my personal vehicle slot we are going to be requesting out our anti-aircraft trailer as soon as this vehicle hits the map and we can see it registered with the tracker on our mini map you can feel free returning it to storage you will know that this vehicle has been tied to your personal vehicle slot we have already attempted to enter and were prevented with our friends so we know that we are in a state of limbo and we have just tied that vehicle to our slot so I'm going to go ahead and look away for a moment. As soon as my MOC appears, I'll be ready to enter alone. Alright, so now that your MOC is here, it's very important that you don't call another vehicle out onto the map. You don't want to disrupt your AA trailer being tied to your character slot. We have our unique motorcycle still in the back of our MOC. We can get the Franklin alert and enter alone. Once you come out and fall through the map, go ahead and get on the DMO AA trailer. 
And now because the AA trailer likes to fall through the map, it'll do the same thing with DMO, but you'll see your character quickly get off. And this is totally fine. You can get back on, you can get off and stay invisible. It'll take about 10 seconds for that to despawn. Well, from your character, because this is the, from DMO, I'm still going to have that street version on the map. All right. And so I always suggest using your up anatomizer and trying to shoot it. If you can't knock it out of the way, you're going to have to call a vehicle in to get it from the middle of the road. All right. But at this point, we have the AA trailer in the back of our MOC and we have our unique motorcycle stored inside of our bunker inside of the AA trailer slot and so if you would like to you can return your motorcycle you can return your MOC to storage go to vehicles and request your anti-aircraft trailer and that unique motorcycle will show up and then you can request your MOC and give it back to yourself or you can use your motorcycle club as I suggest and simply request your unique motorcycle out now this one doesn't have any extra protections on its slot as it was the first special vehicle slot afforded to GTA Online. And so when I take this motorcycle to the back of the MOC this time, I will get the full alert. Because this is our push vehicle, we've got it stored in a unique location. After we get the Franklin alert, we're ready to enter alone. We're just going to be taking our unique motorcycle back to ourselves. All right, perfect. Now you should be able to drive out this time as you didn't get banged around. You can see I still had the Cerberus and the RCV tied to the walls, but we have just completed the circle and we're right back to where we belong. We have successfully received the modded AA trailer and stored it back into our bunker. And now we have the Carbon RS back to the MOC. It's our unique motorcycle, but we don't have any more special vehicles to receive. And since I don't want to lose this unique motorcycle, I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I return it to storage and call out another donor car to lose before I get in the next vehicle. And so because this vehicle is stored at the back of my MOC when I hit right d-pad I will not get the full alert and even though I'm dealing with personal vehicles I can still apply the concepts I'm gonna return my motorcycle to storage and I'm just gonna call out a donor car for me to lose and I know that whatever location this vehicle comes from my carbon RS you calling will for be some pushed wheels? into it I'm Johnny slot. on the spot and I'll so hook you up. I'll just go to my garage 3 and it's request on the way. out of Fagio, something really simple. And as soon as it hits my map and I can see the tracker, I'm just going to enter alone and take the first modded DMO personal vehicle that's out waiting for me. All right, so I'm just going to be receiving this rat loader. And again, I will get the black screen and I'm going to need my friend's invite. And even though these are personal vehicles, all the DMO vehicles act this way, but for you, you may just be able to walk out. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and make a quick cutscene so I can burn through and receive these personal vehicles. And every time I do, I'll just be calling out a vehicle that I can lose. And as you can see, I'm just using Fagios to quickly go through the process, to get glitched out, to leave a car on the map, to take a modded car, get the invite, go back outside, get another donor vehicle to lose, and we can continue forward just like that. Alright? motorcycle and make sure to give it to ourselves 
now that we're done receiving vehicles as I said it's always best to complete the circle and make sure that you have this unique motorcycle stored in the back of your MOC whether you're going to push it out or not just so that you are prepared it's an important thing for you to remember that if you stay ready you won't have to get ready perfect now I'm just gonna go ahead and get myself on glitched so we can go ahead and take a look at the damage all right we're gonna check everything out and make sure it's stored in the correct location just in case you forgot who it is that reigns supreme allow me to remind you that your man cash is has and always will be King. Now, I hope this video has to help you to see how you can effectively manipulate and utilize your slots with gift cards to friends without getting unglitched in the same session, receiving personal vehicles and all types of special vehicles in a row. And soon you'll be trading like a pro no problem all right and so i hope this video helps you guys out as always be safe have a great day everybody